hang out with a lot of uh, Oscar-y type people. You are good friends with Miss Jane Fonda. Well, you know, Jane, I met because her son worked on Soldier's Girl all right. those years ago. And now, look at you with that angel. I mean, Aww. the beauty of that. And you've gotten to hang out with her, hang out at her house. I'm so jealous. I, yeah. love, I love me some Jane Fonda. She's, well, you know, I um, we, we did, we shot Monster-in-Law together, so I got to meet J-Lo on right. the set of that and all that. But What was your favorite story from Monster-in-Law, favorite J-Lo, J-Fo moment? Um, well, the director was this little uh, sweetheart from Australia or New Zealand. Sorry, Australia and New Zealand people. I <laughs> oh, how dare you, Cal Penny? How dare you? How can you not remember us all? Couldn't tell the difference then. And, um, but he would buzz around on this tiny little Segway type thing, like, it, was uh. like a, it made a Jetson <laughs> sound almost. And so Jane, you know, grabbed me and she's very serious. She's like, Calpurnia, come with me. And so we, we go on set and she sits me down and then J-Lo sits on the other side of me. So J-Fo is J here Fo and J-Lo there and yeah. And, you know, Jennifer was very friendly. We didn't exchange a lot of words, though, because she was getting into character. It was a very complex character she played yeah. in Monster-in-Law. Very complex. It, she had to be pretty <laughs> and look good. And pretty. And also and, be pretty yeah. and likable. Well, <laughs> the, it was right before the scene where she mashes, or where Jane mashes her face into the cake. Oh, so. serious. I mean, I'm surprised you weren't mentioned in the Oscar speech that she... <laughs> Oh, wait a minute, she didn't win one for Monster-in-Law. That was a crime! Well, she, she didn't consult me. No, I that's think. right. She could have. Had she for Monster-in-Law, J-Lo, you could have had an Oscar. Because I know about cakes. Oh, yes, you do. Cakes. You cakes, cakes, <laughs> cakes, cakes. Speaking of all those letters, I think that the letters that best apply to me would be double D. Oh, yes, the they do, honey. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Calpurnia, you've spoken at Oxford. You've been around the world. But you know what I still love about you is that you are still not afraid to be a showgirl and do songs <laughs> like this. Hit it. Like it Oh, no beer Johnny in that one. I felt yeah. like I was a baby in that. That's what I was, did they? When you went to speak at Oxford, were they like, and Miss Calpurnia Adams and her latest hits, like in big zigs. Yes, they, they had an elderly British lady on a giant organ oh my God. playing back. All the bottoms in the cloud. <laughs> Getting freaky. <laughs> oh my God. Well, that next time you go to Oxford, please ask for that. Yeah. 